Welcome back to my math lesson. So, like I said, we are continuing with indices. This is the next one we're going to do now. So for x, that is 4x in bracket raised to power 3 equals to 2 raised to power 9. So we are asked to solve for x. So again, let me quickly say this. If this is the first time of you coming across my video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Mathematics with a Number You, and my TikTok channel, so that anytime I put new content, you will be one of those that will be notified. And please don't forget to also share the video. Share the video with your friends, share it with your colleagues, because it encourages us to do more. Okay, so now let's quickly break this down. This is simple. Normally, this is a GCSC question, and you are not supposed to do this for more than, not supposed to take you more than two minutes. So, the thing you need to know is how to break this down. The first thing we need to do is to open this bracket because this is the same as. 4 multiplied by 3 in bracket raised to power 3 and this is 2 raised to power 9 so you can equal sorry this is x that's 4 multiplied by x so you can equally say this is 4 raised to power s multiplied by x raised to power 3 is equals to 2 raised to power 9 so now this is we have base 2 here and this is 4 so we can change this to base 2 also and collect like terms how do we do that this will not turn to 2 raised to power 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by x raised to power 3 is equals to 2 raised to power 9 so this is 2 multiplied by 3 is 6 that's 2 raised to power 6 multiplied by x raised to power 3 is equals to 2 raised to power 9 so now let's take this to the other side. What do we do? Divide both sides. Divide both sides by 2 raised to power 6. 2 raised to power 6. So if you do that, this will go away. So we now have only x raised to power 3 is equals to 2 raised to power 9 over 2 raised to power 6. So by the law of indices, we know that since they both have the same base and they are dividing by, he said, a raised to power n uh, over a raised to power b is equals to a raised to power n minus b. So we know that. So you can use that one here. And that will give us 2 raised to power 9 minus 6, which is equals to 2 raised to power 3. Now, we have x raised to power 3, 2 raised to power 3. So since they are both raised to the same power, our x will be equals to 2. So which means x is equals to 2. That's it. Thank you. So have a nice time.